Hi, green lovers. It is late June in Northern California, Zone 9B, and I wanted to show you my San Marzano tomato plant. Now, this plant is in a planter that's about four feet long, two feet across, and about three feet tall, and it is just loaded with tomatoes. As you can see, I've got some companion basil growing here, which is thriving as well but I wanted to show you how many tomatoes there are on this small short plant that's probably about two and a half feet tall. It is just simply loaded. I counted uh, about 85 and then I stopped counting. I, I'd say there's easily about a hundred tomatoes on this little plant. So this is a super productive plant and of course when I put this on Facebook and my feed just lit up with questions about what I did to get this kind of a harvest. Really all I did was I amended this planter last fall with alfalfa pellets and compost and kept it idle all winter long and um, yeah just put this in here and it is growing and growing and producing and producing loads and loads of tomatoes. Now I think it's a determinate plant because of just the nature of how it's growing. It's short and stocky, but San Marzanos do tend to be indeterminate. I think there is a determinate variety as well. Sorry, I had to catch, capture that honeybee. It's enjoying my black-eyed Susan. And yeah, I had to lift it off the ground. I had not tied it up and I've not pruned this plant by the way and it was shading out all these little eggplants. I just sort of threw some extra eggplants in here and they're obviously too close together but you know this is one of those things where if they grow they grow if not no worries that kind of thing. So and this tomato plant is just awesome so I have um, tied it with just just to kind of lift it off the ground it was kind of vining um, and I just lifted it off with this but it doesn't seem to be growing much taller it's just growing really wide in fact it's wider than it is tall and if that's how it wants to grow and if that's how it wants to grow in order to produce like this I am not going to come in the way of it so grow some San Marzano tomatoes folks they are great paste tomatoes uh, they are the classic tomato for tomato sauce uh, sorry for pasta sauce for pizza sauce and uh, Neapolitan pizzas require that you use San Marzano tomatoes so definitely grow these they're super productive and if you are in Northern California which is where I live they obviously grow really really well live green and love your greens Thank you.